Hey guys, good morning. It's Monday, Monday at 10.30. little morning follow-up to the market here. I'm still short um, the Dow, and I am long some individual stocks. We talked about these uh, IPOs, and that's really where the action's been at. Um, I've been in a big position in solo, but I sold more of it today. Kind of working my way out of it. S-O-L-O. These electric car companies are doing fantastic. Um, it's starting to break a little bit of a, a bear wedge. Um, it had the ability and the possibility to really get rocking and rolling. Not that it hasn't. Um, it's already it was already up about 45-50% for the day. So um, looks a little played out for now. Probably needs to pull back in. Um, longer term, the chart looks interesting. Interesting though. So let's take a look at that later. Um, on SPY, and and we'll we'll go back into the uh, incredible moves that we've seen on the uh ipos so spy literally and i'll show you what was interesting about that number 317.68 and i'm going to show you why if you kind of look at the recent rally that we've had and we did get above the, the prior high from last week um but we hit my blue channel line it's kind of an intermediate uptrend uptrending line and really got some price rejection you saw when i zoomed in but if we kind of zoom in on the, and I'm gonna pull this back a little bit, but if you zoom in on the reversal, the island um, reversal here that we had on the gap that we're trying to fill, um, we got a little bit of a fill and then we got some rejection. So the market's gonna need more time to push higher in my opinion. But you can see how we're below the, the blue channel trend line that we draw. Um, interesting thing is if you run a Fibonacci and these are important numbers, if you run a Fibonacci from the gap top to the recent pullback bottom, right? And we don't have to be exact here, but if you run a gap, a, a, a number from our Fibonacci from that recent move, you can see if we zoom in here that the 313.84 or 317.84 was literally a 78.6% retracement and we hit what? We hit 317.68. So I need to see this close above 313.30 for a few days. Obviously, it looks like it's going to do that at this point, but you know, it's still early on in the day. Um, and then I can see us making another move to that. We just have a lot of energy and a lot of overhead at that area to push back. Doesn't mean we can't get through. It just means it probably needs more time because we've had some pretty good moves here from this bottom pullback. But look at that Fibonacci perfect. If you make that little Fibonacci intraday, um, not intraday, but you know, Fibonacci within a Fibonacci. Um, lemonade, one we liked from last week. Holy cow, this thing is flying today. Look at the intraday. All these, all these stocks are, are incredible movers. I mean, this was 60 bucks and it hit 96, this IPO, 96 today, 96. So we're out of this, looking for pullbacks along the trend line here. Um, Actually, I should move my little indicator up, see if we get that. Uh, what else do we got? Another, I mean, all these IPOs are going crazy. Um, ARI, I believe it was, or API, it was ARI. Another crazy move. Nope, it's API. And I'm still waiting for Double Down Interactive to, to get cranking. This was literally a low of 48 on Friday, 68 today. Big moves on the IPOs. Um, they sold into the moves, obviously, but huge moves on these IPOs. Another fantastic one, KC, um, King Cloud Software. We've been talking about this one for a while. Another huge move. Look at this. Had a base of around 32 on Friday. Another big move today. Out of some bull flag breaks. Look at that. Another pop pullback. Broke down a little bit. It's kind of rolling. So this might have hit a, hit a high for today at 36.89. Um, what else we got going? Shop, we were short. We covered on Friday. It still looks a little sketchy here. Um, I shorted this morning right off the get-go, uh, but I covered too early. I just I just bought the bought to cover the first dip, so it was just easy money. But um, then it kind of got really weak and then pulled back, and now it's trying to right itself here. Might take another short at it with a, with a stop at 1,051, but I need a little bit more wiggle room since the market's kind of pulled back a little bit intraday. But a lot of these have really been really been flying. Um, API, I'm still, like I said, waiting on DDI. 
Um, DNB is still moving up nicely. I'm still holding that up 58 cents. Um, and then this GRAF has been an interesting move too. That's a recent, a recent um, issue. Um, but solo, solo might not be done yet. I just think that you know the momentum traders are kind of going in and out. It's kind of back testing this little trend line from the bottom, uh, descending trend line here. But I don't think it's done yet. She needs to get on the other side of this line, which is trying to do right now, and maybe form another base, and then maybe we make a run at the uh, we make a run at the high later on. But the market's kind of dictating the move here as the market pulled back a little bit. Some of these stocks, there you go. Some of these stocks started to uh, pull back a little bit. Doesn't mean they're done by any stretch. See how you once you break that trend line, it pops to the upside. Um, it still could be the extent of that move, and that's it. But uh, we shall see. This needs a little bit more time, I think. So, but so still looks really interesting longer term. Very interesting looking chart. Um, let's see what else we got going on today. Let's think about taking a short position in oil, but the market seems to be all over the place. SEO, I mean, it had a low of 16.40 in pre-market. I hate to buy in the 17s, but um, I might take a short position in oil today too for a little bit of a scalp trade there. Nothing fantastic. So so far, the market's running at a little bit of selling energy here on the high end. That's why I'm continuing to hold my short position in the Dow. We'll see how it plays out. It's not big. It's just a hedge because I do have a lot of longs working currently. So we'll see how that works out as well.